Few inventions in history have had a profound and enduring influence on human endeavors and development as that of the invention of motor vehicles. People have been able to move from one point to the other in more comfortable and quicker ways than anyone could have foreseen. As global interest to shift to cleaner energy through the adoption of electric vehicles continues to gather pace, the country's energy regulator, the Energy Regulation Board, is geared for the new industry. We developed a concept paper uh, to help us see how we could uh, deal with this new emerging issue um, so that we provide guidance in the, uh, in the deployment of, uh, of uh, electric vehicles. And the Road Transport and Safety Agency says the institution has already started putting up the regulatory framework and standards for electric vehicles. We have started preparing accordingly, putting up uh, the regulatory framework, the standards. Against that background, we have uh, started this conversation with the African Organization for Standardization, ASRO. For the Zambia Environmental Management Agency, electric vehicles will contribute to a cleaner and safer environment. We have pollution arising from exhaust emissions and some of these pollutants like uh, volatile organic compounds uh, like benzene, they are known cancer causing agents. If you are driving an electric vehicle, you will not pay carbon tax, you are not going to pay any emission uh, charges. And the University of Zambia Don, Dr. Jewit Masinja, has called on government to convene an endeavor for experts in the industry. The skills are there, I believe, but they are dissipated, so we need to bring them together. Meanwhile, Toyota Zambia has hinted that if electric vehicles are to be established in Zambia, government should incentivize the sector. Within a generation, uh, we should be able to, to get there as Africa, provided it would require a lot of government support. Full electric vehicles and hybrid vehicles are there in the world. They've been there for many years. What is needed is infrastructure to support. And that will require government policy, goodwill, and also education. As things stand, the future of the automobile industry looks electric. Local experts are there for challenge to rise to the occasion and participate in this revolution. Masauso, Mukwayaya, ZNBC News, Osaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe.